Hey, I'm Alex. And I'm Brooke of the Farm Food Collaborative at the Food Bank of North Alabama. Do you know who your farmer is? My name is Will Scott. I'm a fifth generation fruit farmer at Scott's Orchard and we're in Hazel Green, Alabama. So my family grows apples and peaches um, across about a thousand acres. We've got 150 acres in fruit trees. My great great grandfather started our farm back in 1901 with apples interplanted with pecan trees. My dad now lives in the original pecan orchard. So we sell our apples right here on our farm and we also have a large wholesale distribution system. We sell our apples all the way from Nashville to Birmingham and Memphis to Chattanooga. We work a whole lot with our local school systems and school systems across the state of Alabama. I would definitely say every child in Alabama has had an, one of our apples offered to them at a cafeteria in their school. Why do farmers farm? It's a, it's a lot of hard work. Even if you aren't out there in the sun, um, you're working from sun up until sundown, probably past sundown most days. You're making things happen. You're making hard work pay off in the long run, and it's a lot of hard work all around. So I enjoy what I do very much, or I wouldn't be doing it. At the end of the day, we gotta make sure we've had plenty of apples picked, the trees have been taken care of, and our customers have been taken care of. They're always a full day. Where do farmers come from? My name's Laura Scott, and I'm Will Scott's mother. Will is, um, a very hardworking young man. Um, he's very persistent. He's very goal oriented. And a lot of his goals are the ones he sets for himself. He, he doesn't require someone to tell him what needs to be done. He can look out and foresee future happenings and see what needs to be done. And he doesn't mind to work to get that. And it makes me very proud to say he's my son, since he is that way. I wonder how he learned to be a farmer. I didn't really learn to be a farmer anywhere. It's just something that happened along the way. So I went to school in Middle Tennessee State University and I got a degree in computer information systems. And when I moved off to school, I realized that I really just enjoyed being here on the farm. So I completed my four years and I came right back here to the farm and I just picked up where I'd left off. Are y'all sure y'all don't want a peach? So when I came back, one of my first goals was to get our good agricultural practices certification. And um, we've used a whole lot of new technology in making that happen so we can track where the apples come from, from the field, through the different hands they pass through, on those different days, and finally where they end up. And we can tell you where the apple came from and who got it. So um, you just pick what variety you've got coming down the line and then every time you do another bag or box, you just pick your pack weight and press it and it'll spit you out a label real quick. Where do farmers work? As a farmer, Will works on 1,200 acres with 150 acres for growing peaches and apples in North Alabama. The farm has buildings for machinery and a place to sell their fruit. What do farmers do? Will sells his fruits at farmer's markets so people like you and I are able to eat really fresh and nutritious peaches and apples. Will also sells to schools so students can eat healthy food in their own school cafeterias. Why eat Farmer Scott's apples and peaches? They are more nutritious because they are grown locally and buying from Farmer Scott keeps our money in our community. So why buy local? The food is fresher and more nutritious. You can be healthier. Your farmer can earn a good living. And our community is stronger. Know your farmer, know your food.